Okay, so today we're gonna to look at why you can't print your emails, why when you try to print them, you only get part of the email. You might get the inbox, the sent items, the junk, and then a list of your emails, just like mine is showing on the screen. Why isn't it printing properly? Well, stick around and we're gonna take a look into it and give you the answer. Don't forget to like this video, share it, and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things help us make more great videos for you. So, as I say, sometimes you might well find you go to print your emails and when you try and print them, you get on the printed output this or something similar where you can't actually see much of the email. Maybe the right hand side of the email is cut off. I mean, in my case here, I can't even actually see the email. What I'm seeing is I'm seeing a list of my folders on the left hand side. Then I'm seeing a list of the emails I've received and I'm only really seeing a smidgen of the email. This is quite a common problem and I get asked about it all the time. So how do you print your emails and why is it doing this? Well, quite possibly what it is when you're going to print your emails, you're going up to the print facility in your browser. So you could well be going up to the three dots along the top there and then clicking on print. And what that's going to do is that is just going to print whatever is showing on your screen. So as you can see here, all of this is showing as well as my emails, and it's just too wide to print on a piece of paper. So how do you ensure that you only get the email? How do you ensure when you print, you only get this part here? Well, what you need to do is you need to find the print function from within the email software itself or the email website. So in this case here, I'm using Outlook. I'm going to show you also how to do this in Gmail and Yahoo Mail. Other email systems should be pretty much the same. In Hotmail or Outlook or Live, then all you do is just make sure you've got the email you want to print on the screen and just click on the three dots in the top right hand corner of the email. Now, if you can't see the three dots, scroll right the way up to the top of the email message, click on the three dots just there and then click on print. And what this is going to do is this is going to reformat the email so that it only shows you the actual email itself and not all the other gump. Then just click on print just up here. And as you'll see here, there you go. In the print preview, it's formatted correctly, not showing all the gump that I had on the left hand side. It is just literally showing the email that I want to print. And all I need to do is just click on the print button and away it goes. Now the same thing can happen in Google as well or Gmail. So let's just open up an email in Gmail. Here we go. So if I try and print by using either control P or go up to the three dots up there and click on print, then we get a similar sort of thing. We get all of the folders in our Gmail account appear on the left hand side. And as you can probably see here, the right hand side of my email is cut off. This is no good. So in Gmail, what we do is we go into the email. Again, we make sure we scroll right up to the top of the email. And in the top right hand corner, there is a picture of a printer just there. Click on that. And once again, what it will do is it will reformat the email so that it can just be printed just the email and not anything else. And as you can see there in the preview, it's going to print the email, just the email, nothing else. And finally, let's go into Yahoo Mail. So as you can see here, I've got my email up on the screen. Again, if I do control P or click on the three dots just up there, click on print, you will see, there you go. It's, it's a complete mess. I can't see the right hand side of the email. I've got all of that muck up the top. I've got my folders along the left hand side. I really don't want to print those. So let's just come out of that. And what we need to do is again, we need to find the picture of the printer in the top, just to the left of the date and the time that the email was received. Click on that and again, reformats it. And as you'll see here, there we go. It's just going to print the content of the email.
if I click on the print button just there. So there you go. I hope this guide helps. And if it did, consider hitting that thanks button and making a donation to this channel. Or if you can't do that, have a look in the description down below. I've got loads of great links down there for you, including a link to my Amazon shop. If you're in the market for a VPN, a Fire TV stick, a Fire TV cube or Fire Stick accessories, we've got loads of great links down there with loads of great deals. Buying, subscribing and donating really does help support this channel. It helps me to be able to spend more time researching to bring you these great videos. And whilst you're at my YouTube channel, why not stick around? I've got thousands of other videos for you right here, right now, covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully whilst you're here, you're going to find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you, and maybe even save you some time and money. And if whilst you're here, you see something that you think your friends, your family, or your work colleagues might like to see, then please don't forget to share these videos on your social media timelines. Check me out on X. I'm at CWTEK. Also check out my website. It's CWTEK.co.uk. Thanks for watching and speak to you again soon.